What up guys? And welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Paul. And today, we're going to be making some cherry barbecue sauce AIP friendly, and it's going to be delicious. So, let's get started. We'll be cutting up some onion into half slices. Uh, real simple, and then just move that off to the side. And we're going to mix up six to eight cloves. Then we'll put that off to the side. You're gonna peel some carrots and cup into little strips or what I've been doing recently, which is even easier and faster, is just shred the carrots. So I'll shred the carrots instead of doing this kind of thing, unless you really, really wanna cut up some carrots. I did throw some ginger in there just to add a little extra something. But if you do use ginger, I would say add a very, very tiny amount. Because it is quite strong. Then you're going to throw in all your aromatics. So all your onion, garlic, and uh, ginger if you add to that. Uh, and let all get that all caramelized. Then you add in uh, your carrots to the mixture. Then you're going to throw in about a fourth a cup of apple cider vinegar along with your cherries. And if you want to make this a little bit sweeter, add some maple syrup to it as well. A little bit extra sweetness. I would also use this smoked salt, which helps give this barbecue flavor a smoky flavor. Now you can get that smoked salt on Amazon, that's where I got it, and uh, I really like it a lot. And once everything cooks for about 20 minutes or so, everything will thicken up and get soft. Then you can just throw it all in the blender. And once everything get blended, make sure and taste it. See if it needs any salt or anything. Uh, for me, I need to add a little more salt. Now you got your cherry barbecue sauce that's AIP friendly. I threw mine in a mason jar, you can throw it in a squeeze bottle, whatever, whatever you guys have on hand. And then just throw the lid on top. Now you got your barbecue sauce. And uh, guys, if you like this, oh, hit the like button. And please subscribe to the channel, it really help me out. I hope to see you guys in the next video. And as always, get out there and create something delicious.